Hey everyone, welcome back to Anxiety Art Adventures. I hope you like my background. I figured this would be a good background to end the Josephine Wall event on. So you get to look at pretty fish while I talk about the end of the event. Um, so welcome all of you lovely Shugs. And um, I'm very, today is a really happy but sad day for me. Um, it is the end of the Josephine Wall event and um, the event went for two months and it was wonderful. I really enjoy seeing all of the progress photos of um, the projects that were worked on for this event and just all of the overwhelming um, kindness and encouragement and participation in this event. It was much larger than I thought it was going to be and I didn't know so many of you um, enjoyed uh, Josephine Wall's artwork and had projects to work on from her. So um, thank you so much to everyone who participated. I could not have done this without you. And um, I just, it's amazing. It's amazing. So thank you guys. Um, and I also want to thank all of the sponsors and I'm going to go over them individually um, because they definitely need the shout outs for that. And then I'm going to go talk about the winners the week eight final winners, the US winner for the pen and the mermaid cover minder, and then also the international winner for the gift card. Um, so we'll get into that in a minute, but I wanna thank all of the sponsors and I have a list over here on my other screen. Um, so we're gonna go through those and make sure we give them um, appropriate credit because I, I was just thrilled with all of these sponsors willing to participate and offer their time and gifts uh, for this event. So uh, the first sponsor we had was Uniquely Yours Down Under, who I worked on a canvas from Uniquely Yours Down Under, and uh, Jennifer was so nice to offer a 10% discount during the event uh, on any any kit that you wanted to purchase. It didn't have to be a Josephine Wall kit, um, but there was a 10% discount for the two months of the uh, event. So Jennifer, thank you so much for offering that discount with Uniquely Ears Down Under. I absolutely love my diamond painting. Um, it turned out beautiful um, and I did, you know, mix some things, some sparklers up uh, in the canvas to bling it out a little, but it turned out gorgeous. So thank you again, Uniquely Ears Down Under for sponsoring um, J-Wall Along 2022. Uh, the next sponsor we had is Lazy River Wood Turning. Matt and Stephanie were so nice to offer four diamond painting pens that Matt handmade uh, for this event. Um, long story short, Matt and I usually go back and forth about, um, you know, me trying to pay for things and he won't let me. Um, it's an ongoing thing with me and him and <laughs> anyway it's 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 kind of a personal thing between uh matt and stephanie and i but um uh yeah anyway so i i'm just really thankful that uh they were willing to offer four pens for the event they are gorgeous pens um as you know if you've watched my videos um for the event and they were so nice to send me a pen as a gift for me hosting this event. So thank you so much to Matt and Stephanie for uh, donating those beautiful pens and for Matt taking the time to make those gorgeous, gorgeous pens. So thank you so much. Um, and of course, all of the sponsor information is going to be in the description so that you can go and check out each one of these sponsors. I have a link to each one of them. Uh, for their products. Uh, Patriotic Team is another sponsor. She offered a beautiful, beautiful ice cream scoop uh, for the event. Sorry, I have cat hair on my nose. <laughs> um, beautiful ice cream scoop. I have, I have an ice cream scoop that I bought from her as well as I purchased uh, two other ice cream scoops for uh, Christmas gifts this year and my family just absolutely loves the ice cream scoops. They are very, um, What's the word I'm looking for? They're very heavy and they're durable. They're not going to break and they are just so pretty to look at. So Stephanie, thank you so much for donating an ice cream scoop to the event. Um, I, I can't say enough about Patriotic Team's products, um, her pens, her resin works. I mean, 
her, her Texas tips, which are so hard to get now, but just everything that she makes is awesome. So thank you so much, Stephanie, for donating the ice cream scoop. And then, of course, we had Muni Maid. Uh, I reached out to Muni Maid and asked Em if she would be willing to um, donate a tray to the event, and she was thrilled to do it. So I just can't thank Em enough for donating a tray set to the event. Um, as all of you know that Diamond Paint, uh, Muni Maid's trades are absolutely top-notch and, in my opinion, some of the best trays that we have in this community and I use her trays on a daily basis so uh, thank you so much um, for donating that tray set to the event and Randa's Crafty Corner Randa has a small Etsy shop and she has putty wax cover binders um, I use her putty on a regular basis I actually use putty now over wax I don't use wax anymore um, I enjoy the putty uh, more so because it lasts longer and I actually use it in my single placer and my multi placers so uh, thank you so much Randa for donating putty to the event um, I know that you know Randa hand makes this putty and um, her time is you know valuable so thank you so much Randa and by the way Randa congrats again on moving into your new home I love it I've seen the videos and all your pictures and it's gorgeous so congrats um, Cover Miner Saban, uh, another just wonderful person in this community. Uh, Saban is always willing to comment on videos and participate in lives and always willing to donate to events. Um, I just can't speak highly enough about Saban. I absolutely adore her and her cover miners are just gorgeous and I have quite a few of them that I use on a regular basis so thank you so much Saban for offering cover minders to this event um, all of the you know winners that actually got your cover minders are going to be thrilled once they get them in their hands and can see them up close the camera doesn't do them justice so thank you Saban for um, donating those to the event and then of course we have the beautiful Sandra West who I was just honestly I was moved to tears when Sandra messaged me and said that she wanted to donate two Josephine art books to this event um, you know and she wanted to do one for an, a US winner and one for an international winner um, all I'm gonna say is the the fact that Sandra took time out of her really hectic schedule right now and everything going on um, I was just I was just overwhelmed with um, gratitude because uh, Sandra in my opinion is such a huge important part of this community she is in pretty much anyone's lives that I've been to um, she always comments on videos and is always active on Instagram and just I, I just can't speak enough about Sandra so um, thank you so much Sandra for offering those beautiful books and I know that the um, the recipients of those books are going to be absolutely blown away by the beautiful artwork and that also gave you know everyone a chance to focus on the actual artwork of Josephine Wall instead of you know a diamond painting um, or a cross stitch so um, this event was to highlight Josephine Wall and her beautiful works of art. So, Sandra, thank you so much. I really appreciate uh, you donating those books. It was such, it was just so awesome to get that get that message from you offering that. So, thank you so much. Um, yes. Yeah, so, those were the sponsors of the event. Um, so now we're going to get into the winners, the final winners for week eight of the J-Wall Along 2022. Okay, so the U.S. winner for the Lazy River Wood Turning Pen and the Gold Mermaid Cover Minder from Saban is Albain El Nahas. And I will have um, here, I will have the winner image as well as a picture of what she worked on. Um, she actually finished Gemini from Josephine Wall that's offered by Diamond Art Club. It's absolutely gorgeous. I have this diamond painting. I didn't work on it for the event because it was square drills and at that time I was 
not a fan of square drills, um, but I hopefully will work on it next year for the event. Um, I am going to do the event next year. Uh, so Albain, thank you so much for participating and congratulations on getting a Lazy River wood turning pen and a Mermaid Coverminder from Coverminder Saban. So congratulations. Um, and then our international winner uh, for a $50 gift card to either Etsy or to a diamond painting company of your choice um, is Angela Cooper. Angela Cooper, congratulations. Um, Angela worked on and is still working on Flight of the Lynx from Diamond Painting Deutschland. And it is an absolutely, and I'll put it here, um, it is an absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous diamond painting. Um, I, if I had known that was there, I probably would have gotten it because, you know, a lynx, it's a cat, anything cat related, you know, I'm a sucker for. Um, but it is just a gorgeous diamond painting. And the good thing about this event um, is I didn't require a finish for the event because I know a lot of these diamond paintings and cross stitch projects, um, especially of Josephine Wall's uh, works of art, are very large and, you know, I just don't like putting a time limit on on an event that's supposed to be fun and projects that we're supposed to enjoy. So um, I personally will probably never put a required finish on any event. Um, so anyway, congratulations to Angela Cooper. Um, I have already messaged the uh, winners and um, they will get back to me or they've already gotten back to me by the time you see this video uh, so yes so the other thing I want to say is that all of the prizes for the event are going to be mailed out um, probably the first week of May um, I know a lot of the sponsors are going to be sending things out on their own um, so that way you know they don't ship things to me and then I have to ship things out to you all um, that kind of doubles the shipping it doesn't really make a lot of sense so um, for those of the sponsors that are shipping things directly, I am going to message all of them uh, the winner information with all of their, you know, addresses on where to send them to. Um, and then the items that I have here, I will ship them out myself to all of you. And of course, the gift cards are through email so that um, those are, you know, easily to be received without having to pay shipping costs. So um, congratulations to all of the winners of the event. Um, I was thrilled to be able to offer weekly prizes uh, with as many generous sponsors that I had. I was able to do weekly prizes. So again, thank you to the sponsors of the event and to everyone who participated. Um, yeah, so I am planning to do this event next year, same time frame. Uh, March 1st of 2023 and it will go through um, the end of April of 2023 um, so hopefully that'll give you plenty of time <laughs> to get another Josephine Wall uh, diamond painting kit or cross cross stitch kit um, yeah I'm, I'm really looking forward to doing it again next year so please feel free to put um, you know any comments questions you have down below and um, let me know what you would work on next year if you want to participate in the event, what diamond painting or cross stitch uh, you're interested in working on that's Josephine Wall related. Uh, I would love to, to know what you plan on working on next year. Um, hopefully I'm going to work on Gemini, uh, which I am a Gemini, so that's why I got that diamond painting kit. And um, from what I've seen, it's just an absolute gorgeous, gorgeous kit. Uh, so I'm looking forward to that. So again, I've rambled long enough. Thank you all so much for uh, such an awesome event. And also, I do want to thank um, Bev and Stephanie that were my moderators in the Facebook group. Um, what we'll probably do is um, we'll archive that group um, at the end of the event, which is now. And we'll archive that group and then we'll reopen that group and just re title it for 2023 um, because I know a lot of you use Facebook instead of Instagram and I wanted to have that option um, so Bev and Stephanie thank you so much for moderating that group and you know handling you know day-to-day -day things that I I didn't really have a lot of time to do especially with everything going on with me right now 
Um, so I can't thank them enough for being awesome moderators. So thank you. Thank you, Shooks. Okay. I think I've gone over everything. Um, yes. So hope you all enjoyed this video with the beautiful fish. And uh, yeah, I have no idea what I'm going to work on next, actually. I know there are a lot of events going on that I'm interested in. Uh, so I have a couple of options that I could work on in May. Um, yeah, I'm not sure. And then, of course, summer with the Masters starts, I think, in June. And I do have a kit, a custom kit ready for that uh, from uh, Uniquely Ears Down Under. So I'm excited about that. And then July starts the event that Patriotic Team and I are hosting, uh, which is TSA Knockout 2022. That is um, just any TSA kit that runs from July to the end of December. And then in August, I'm doing um, Claws and Paws with uh, Diamond Painting with Pities. That's Brie. So lots of exciting things going on. And I know there are all kinds of events going on. So please um, check out all the events and, you know, Hopefully you can participate in some of them. So I hope all of you have a great, great weekend and I will see you again very soon. Bye guys.